Okay, the week has reset. We ended the week on about 21.3 million and we're up to 92,000 at the moment. So hopefully we can just keep farming well and hopefully get a little bit closer to the top 10 this week. We definitely got the troops for it. Just a little update on the rating. We've rated one at million now and we're in the top 10, currently ranked ninth. Hopefully we can keep this up because we're doing pretty well at the moment. I'll show you the top 10, there we go, 1.6 mil, we're still in the top 10, which is pretty good I think. Okay, it's time for the nightly update. There's how much we've farmed, almost 2.2 mil, uh, they're starting to catch us, number 10 is, so I don't think we'll be in the top 10 much longer, but um, we did good there to stay there most of the day since it reset, so I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, you can see here that we're off to sell a new village and it's six hours away. You may be wondering what the hell are you thinking? But yeah, I'm settling out here. I did a calculation of where I think the artifact, the boots or the trainer would spawn and somehow I come up with this number. Don't ask me how, but yeah. So what I'm basically going to do is I'm going to make catapults in here, about 150 of them, and if an artifact spawns close to here, I will be able to use the catapults to send it to take out the treasury. I'm obviously going to send my hero with um, the capital one, and then have Mapsor pick up the artifact with his hero. Because I won't be able to pick it up till the treasury is destroyed. I'll show you the troop counts now. So we've got 52k clubs and almost 13k TK with 5.2k rams. So not looking too bad. So still in a bit of work needs to be done on this to up those numbers for artifacts. And also a lot of smithy work needs to be done on them as well. So you can see that they're lacking in smithy at the moment but they're both upgrading and I still need to uh, upgrade rams a bit more in here but there's no plan to use this ram mask so it's not crucial that I do it straight away okay let's take a look at the general tab and here we can see the resources per day and so far and then military str strength to rank three. And there's defensive strength. And culture point rank finally. Okay, it's time for a little update again. Top 10 Raiders, we are still ranked 10th. We've raided eight mil so far. 400K behind adrenaline at the moment. So we're doing pretty well to stay in there. I really hope we can keep it up and get that Raider ribbon at the end of this week. There's um, some pretty big efforts gone into it. Troop count, there we go. 61k clubs, 15k TK. It's growing fast now. Looking really good. Almost 6k rams too. Very, very happy with it. Okay, here are item. I will show you. Uh, I got the Mace of the Club Swinger, finally. It took forever to get this item. There was none on the auctions for literally like two to three days. It was crazy. I was refreshing it like every two hours looking for some, but yeah. I also got a shield in an adventure that I managed to sell for 2000. So it basically paid for like some of this club swinger itself. Uh, so that was pretty nice to get. Uh, it went for about 5000, which is pretty cheap. Yeah, still going for a lot more expensive than that, coming up to artifacts and that, but I really wish I'd have bought those ones because those ones ended up being cheaper than that one. But uh, supply and demand will definitely make them a lot more expensive, and you can see Boots of the Warrior are still very expensive. And there's the shield that we got. We also got Teutonic Knights, 76 of them in Adventure, and yeah, the Boots of the Warrior and the map. So we got pretty lucky in Adventures. We got three tier two items and a TK one. So it was pretty nice, I think. 
and the items that we got, like Boots of the Warrior and Map, are ones I would have bought anyway, so that helped majorly. And let's have a look at the Catapult Village. So Workshop's going to level 8. Not extending the resource tiles in there, just doing the minimalist things. Um, because I'm going to zero pop it once artifacts are done, and I have no use for this uh, village anymore. So yeah, I don't really want to make a settlement out here. So yeah, just going to get that academy 15, workshop 10, extend the rally point to 15, get a tournament square. And just in the supports here, getting uh, Heroes Mansion up a couple of levels to take some more oasis there. Here is the cropper I want to settle. Somebody settled it, so I am going to zero pop it. And the general tab to finish things off. Resource rank. Military strength, still number three. Defensive. And culture points. Okay, time for a little update. Here's the troop counts. We got 67k clubs and 16.5k TK with 6.4k rams going pretty awesome I'll show you the top 10 we have raided 12.7 mil so we're about 400k behind number 10 which is awesome going really well this week um, hopefully we can sneak in there I was still a long way off the top number one number two number three but yeah we're doing pretty good okay, let's have a look at the general tab while we're here so resource rank is so far military strength still third and defensive and culture points so yeah all going pretty well um catapult village is up to 34 catapults um i did let my daffodil chief my spawn village so i'll show you that one i hate how that happens it's really freaking annoying so you can see here I just like let him chief it I didn't need it anymore everything I was donating was going into resources bonus and great parties in there I mean it's sad to lose that great party but yeah I think it would be better served with um, me selling a new village up here and internet is slow this morning so yeah you can see and there uh, all chiefed so the village i want to settle is the 15 cropper it's zero percent but it's still a 15 cropper so they're 8.1 squares away working on that now getting residents to level 10 and gonna make settlers in there and then settle that one okay the nightly update we're at 16.4 million almost 16.5 so we've raided about 3.7, 3.8 mil today, which I think is um one of our best days so far this weekend. Damn, number nine and number ten, they just pulled ahead of us all day. Like we were catching them when I woke up, and then just out of nowhere, these Lithuanians in their night time just went crazy farming, and yeah, they just smashed us like. They were like three to four hundred k ahead when I woke up this morning and updated you, and now they're like one point four million ahead, and we had a fantastic rating day. So yeah, so did they. It looks like okay. So there's the top ten done. Um, here's our troop count now. We're up to seventy two k clubs, and seventeen point six k TKs and six point seven k Rams. Looking pretty nice. You can probably see that um, I've done some work in the cap hammer as well. We had, since our rating was so good today, actually, um, I had some spare resources to whack into that army. So yeah, we only need like another 1,000 uh, TKs and another 2,800 clubs in there in three days. It's about three days to artifacts now, I guess. Maybe, no, it's actually four, four days. Um, yeah, because... Um, I'm in Australia and ahead of time. So yeah, four days, well, three days and 23 hours or something like that until artifacts. So yeah, so we should be looking pretty good by then. 
Um, I'll show the smithy level. I've been getting that up slowly with each NPC. The clubs will be done in 20 there and I'll get TK to 20 tomorrow. And then I will take down the smithy in the capital. I'm not going to get catapults and rams there. And make the treasury chamber in there ready to go. So we're all set up and ready to go. Uh, for artifacts and hopefully we get a good spawn. Um, you probably saw on the troop counts that uh, We had 65 catapults in there. I settled the cropper today So just getting the fields up in there that will do us a world of good for our minus 127k And uh, let's take a look at the general. I haven't looked at the general tab since this morning, so Have a look at that um, resource rank uh, put that in so far. Military, I still rank three, of course. Not taking anyone over there. Defensive rank and culture point rank. Yeah. Really slacking now. I like rank two hundred and sixty-five population. Uh, because um, my definite chief to spawn and that took like a good six hundred population off us. But hopefully we can build up, and hopefully a chief target comes along sooner or later. Anyway, that's tonight's update. Do you like morning and nightly updates or do you just like nightly updates? Let me know in the comments and I'll see what I can do about those.